What's up, YouTube? Salvo G here, and welcome back to another reaction video. Today, we have a song called Forget Me Not from Bad English. Bad English is a band we haven't heard yet, or I haven't heard yet. You guys may be, may be familiar with them, but this will be a first time listen for me and all thanks to Regina over on Patreon. Thanks for being a VIP member of the channel, supporting my channel and giving me some good suggestions. All right. The last one was really fun, by the way. So thanks for the weird Al. I'll do some more real weird Al on my own, guys. So um, look forward to that as well. But anyways, moving on with this one. All right, bad English. Let's get into this group. Let's see what they're doing here. Hard Rock, AOR, Arena Rock. What does this stand for? Oh, OK, yeah, it is Arena Rock. Um, Let's see. And what was that? Glam Metal. Awesome. We don't get too much Glam Metal. Hard Rock Super Group formed in 87. It reunited Journey keyboardist Jonathan Kane with singer John White and bassist Ricky Phillips, his former band bandmates in the ba the Babies. Almost said Babies. The Babies, along with Journey guitarist Neil Scone and drummer Dean Castronovo. All right, the band is known for their hit single, When I See You Smile, which peaked at number one on the Hot 189. All right, so we got a super group here. That is nice. I guarantee this is going to be extremely polished. So that's exciting. How many albums? Just two. Just two albums. This particular album is the debut album. Self-titled. Massive success. Especially because of... The one song we just mentioned, When I See You Smile, the single was certified gold, while the album was platinum. Aside from this, that song, the album had two other top 40 hits, Price of Love and Possession, which peaked at number five and number 21, respectively. And this person also said the song Forget Me Not is the best cut, which is what we're listening to. So that's exciting. That's, that's nice to hear. So we're just going to get right into it. Here we go.
<laughs> you will be touched by love. 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 Stairway to your world. You can feel me there, and you know I'm waiting. I will be your keeper. You possess the key. Forget me not, forget me not. Cause you belong to me. I will be your shadow. So the first thing that sticks out to me is that it adds like this um raw sound of a hard rock or an arena or arena rock sound to a to the emotional depth of a power ballad. So you you kind of appeal to multiple crowds and adds this unique dynamic and sound. So I really thought that was cool. Another thing, the production again and the sound is really really good i kind of expect that after hearing super group and the, the the lead guitarist who is on the lead guitar here because oh my gosh neil wow so neil was the lead guitarist of the rock band journey which makes sense because he absolutely kills this the are the solos are well crafted melodic and it adds to the edge in what is kind of a power ballad song if I'm thinking about it now. So it, it adds more edge to it along with the uh, like the anthem that's going on with the lyrics. It's very singable. Get me not, get me not. And it has like all the things you want in a hard rock song or a power ballad. It kind of just like gives you all these things it's such a well-crafted song i feel like and that usually is the case with these super groups i feel like although a lot of the times i feel like they don't really have too many albums why is that whenever there's a super group that pops up it's like they do one two three and then like um a compilation album and then that's it so like but a lot of the songs are really good so they just come together they make a lot of good music and they're like okay yeah feel good about that and then they like they just go their separate ways again it's very bizarre it's not but not bizarre but just different from what i'm used to seeing like you, you click on a band and they have like you know a list of albums so but that was uh that was exceptional the lyrics the guitar work the drums were even very like driving and fun and loud the guitar, yeah, the lead vocal, everything about this was really good. Tons of fun, easy to sing along to, and yeah, great voice. I just want to scream this one. I'm gonna play it again, but I gotta, I gotta wrap this one up. Long video. Wow, I'm, I'm yapping. All right, thanks, for, thanks for watching, guys. Thanks again to Regina. That was a really fun one. Make sure you guys subscribe before you go. That's all I got. Catch you in the next one. Peace.